In this question, we are given a function gx, which is actually the max of 5 minus x and x plus 2. So first of all, what does this even mean? Well, let's try and calculate g0. So g0 will be max of 5 comma 2. Now, which one is bigger? 5. What will be g1? Will be max of 5 minus 1 is 4 and 1 plus 2 is 3. Maximum of the two values is 4. So that is essentially what our function gx is. Now, we are asked to find out the smallest possible value of gx. So what do I do? Do I apply calculus or any of those fancy ideas? No. Think very, very simple. This 5 minus x is essentially a line. This is a line which has a negative slope. So the line, I'm not drawing even the axis, but it will be a decreasing line. It will be something like this. Whereas x plus 2 will be an increasing line. So let's say this is my line x plus 2 and this is my line 5 minus x. At any point of time, I have to take the maximum of the two values. So I will first keep on taking this 5 minus x till the point where they intersect and then I will start taking x plus 2. So this is essentially what my graph would look like. Rough drawing, but this is broadly what it would look like. Now I need to find out the smallest possible value of gx. When is it the smallest? When the two lines intersect? And when do the two lines intersect? When 5 minus x is x plus 2, which means 2x is equal to 3 or x is equal to 1.5. And when x is equal to 1.5, what is the value of gx? gx is max of 5 minus 1.5 or 3.5, x plus 2, 1.5 plus 2 or 3.5. So the maximum possible value of gx, sorry, the smallest possible value of gx is 3.5, which is not there in the options. So I'll mark none of these option D. Thank you.